Hey, what's up? It's Chanel. Welcome to a new episode of Vital Vinyl Vlog. Today we're going to be blasting some head split records. Thrash metal that's not from Chile, from Italy. Death Fucker with their new album, Fire Spawn. Ripping thrash metal. If that's your cup of tea and you like things speedy with killer riffing and vocals that harken the past, you can't really go wrong with Death Fucker. I mean, they're one of those bands where you kind of have to ignore the name a little bit because you can't take it too seriously. But at the same time, why not take it seriously? Because I really like the image that this band has just of fucking thrashing maniacs with Insulter on vocals and guitars, Pest on bass and JK on drums, Hails to the Following Hordes, Hellish Sound Captured. So I really do like the, uh, you know, evil vibes that Death Fucker have on Fire Spawn. Has a very, like, chillin' thrash slash speed metal sound to it. And it's good. So, if you like your thrash metal, like a little bit evil, ripping, with kind of more black metal oriented vocals. This is a band I wouldn't ignore. Headsplit still has copies of this. Like, it's just totally a ripper if you're a fan of like thrash metal. Like, this seriously will make your hair grow like three inches with each listen. There's amazing guitar solos. The guitar work on here is, to me, the main draw to uh, Fire Spawn. Like, the last I heard Death Fucker, uh, ah, fuck. I, I forget what it, I, oh man, I forget the name of it. It was the one before this, but I, I remember, like, I really liked it. And this is really good, like, I threw the B-side on, so this started with um, Temple of Adoration, Hail Predator, Violated Salvation, Where Life Dwells In, and then Side A, Title Track, Fire Spawn, Damnation Strikes, Sacrificial Slaughter, which sounds like a Slayer song, just the title. Uh, measuries of Hatred and Plague Descends make up this nine track attack of ripping blackened thrash metal, I would say, with speedy elements of days past. It's killer. Like, if you're a fan of, you know, thrash metal, this is something that. You could definitely down a 42 and, you know, enjoy. Especially if this band plays live. Holy shit. Like, I don't know what Italy's situation is right now, but if, you know, a band like Death Fucker is playing live, I would try and make it out to that show. Because it's probably going to be gnarly, but, you know, be respectful if you do go. Like, if a circle pit picks up. You can't stay six feet apart from one another, so it's one of those risks you have to take. Same with, like, crowd surfing. Like, you're going to a thrash metal show. Like, if you don't want people jumping on top of you and stuff, even in these days where that's extremely risky, you know, just don't stand up front. That's all I can really tell you from my experience at a at the decibel festival like just stand where you feel safe i also have an injury so i had to be in a safe spot but you 
I don't know, if you feel weird about that type of stuff and you're at a show and you don't want to have like a panic attack, just stand in the back. Like nobody's gonna think you're like a wimp or anything. Like they'll understand. But if you're one of those maniacs that just doesn't give a fuck and just wants to have a good old time, circle pit with two forties taped to your hand. Listen to death fucker. And even if you're fucking straight edge, if you just like ripping thrash metal from Italy. Fire spawn. I can't headbang, so. Rip. So, yeah, if you like thrash metal, especially with a little blackened edge to it, you're gonna love Death Fucker. If you haven't heard it before, Head Split Records, killer Italian thrash metal. And something that sounds very South American in execution, but it's not. And very enjoyable stuff right here. But, like, when it comes to, you know, speedy thrash metal and just mayhemic metal in general, I really love Nuclear Revenge, Dawn of the Primitive Age. This release right here is my fucking shit. Like, I don't know, I've been kind of holding a lot of, uh like speed metal and thrash releases up against this. And I'm really excited also for the new Witch's Hammer record. And I know there's a difference between speed metal and thrash metal, but still I like kind of putting them, you know, into a similar category. But when it comes to Death Fucker sound, this is like ripping thrash metal Sounds very South American, evil, but it's from Italy, filled with killer riffs, amazing guitar work, good vocals, and just an all-around good package of thrash metal across nine tracks. Yeah, you get your money's worth on cassette on Head Split Records. I'm not the biggest thr thrash metal fan, but, like, when I find a release I like, you know, I stick to it. And, like I said, that Nuclear Revenge release, I fucking love that. So, it's just so good. It, I don't know. And same with, like, Vomit and whatnot. Like, I fucking love this band. Like, they just... They're so fucking evil sounding and speedy and it's just, yeah, man, fucking 80s death thrash metal reign supreme, awesome stuff. But like there's so many subgenres of like thrash metal from pizza thrash, <laughs> whatever. It's ripping evil thrash metal from Italy. Death Fucker with Fire Spawn, Head Split Records, 7.5 out of 10. I just have to be in the mood for thrash metal. And like I said, there's other releases that I go to if I'm in the mood for some thrash. Like, I don't have any Vader records anymore, so like, I'll throw on Oxygen Destroyer. I don't have the new Oxygen Destroyer, but I'll throw on... Uh, the first record, Bestial Malevolence and whatnot, and enjoy it. I think yeah, the cassette's like right here, I think. 
killer fucking album. The LP's over here. And also, another really fucking killer, ripping, like, thrash metal band, Oath of Cruelty. That band is awesome. Uh, summary Execution at Dawn, like, what a bad-ass record. Like, seriously, so good. But also, you can't go wrong with some kaiju-influenced death thrash. I really need the new cassette, because I missed the LP. Fuck. Ooh, sorry. But, yeah, Oxygen Destroyer, fucking rule. I really need to get the tape. But, also on Head Split Records, Death Fucker with Fire Spawn. Good shit. And as always, thanks for watching, you fucking rule. Hails.